Hey Leos, I appreciate y'all clicking on that thumbnail and checking out my reading. This will be for Leo Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Also check your Jupiter and your North Node, check what signs in your 7th house, and check what house your Sun and your Venus are in. Uh, my email's in the description box for you to email me. <clears throat> y'all, I'm losing my voice, bear with me. My email's in the description box for you to email me any type of... Um, uh, questions, spiritual questions, spiritual topics, and all that for us to talk about on the channel. Um, once I get to a thousand subscribers, I will start going live, like doing live reading, having live discussions, and all that good stuff. We are creeping on up there. So I really appreciate all of the support, you guys. I really appreciate the support, the love offerings, um, the likes, the comments, the subscribes. It's, it's greatly appreciated, okay? Um, also everyone in the situation has free will. If I tap into someone's energy, they have free will. All right. Um, yeah, <laughs> I think that's it. All right. Spirit, let's get started. Also, I want to resonate with every single Leo that watches. Okay. So check out some of your placements. Take what resonates to leave the rest. All right. Passion. Okay, so what first came out was release your ex. And the time has come to clear your energy. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Mm. So you maybe some of you guys have some new love coming in. Um, express your love. And then on the bottom of, of the deck, this could be the one. Hmm. Okay. Well, <clears throat> we're gonna see what this is about. All right, spirit, clarify, release your ex. Oh, the seven of cups. Explore your options, Leo. Um, some of you guys might be stuck on your past, on your ex. Spirit, clarify passion for me. Clarify passion for Leos. Oh, the tower. Oh, I wonder if it's, this is someone that you turned down before. Oh, or you might meet someone unexpectedly. You might have some unexpected rendezvous with someone. Or someone that you least expect you would ever deal with. Yeah. Okay. Spirit, clarify, express your love for Leo's. Oh, yes. The Queen of Wands. Some of you guys might be dealing with a, another fire sign, particularly in Aries. It could also be a Scorpio, you guys. Spirit, clarify this could be the one. Oh, or you might be dealing with another Leo, you guys. The King of Wands. Oh, baby, y'all got the Queen of Wands and the King of Wands. So y'all already know what I... How I feel about that. Okay. So y'all have some um, soulmate energies here. And you do have the, this could be the one oracle here. So um, whoever you're dealing with, you have a lot of passion with. A whole lot. Um, but some of you guys, I'm feeling like, do need to explore your options. You might be stuck on somebody from your past. Okay. And you may have some better options that are right in front of you that you may be overlooking. All right, Spirit, clarify the Seven of Cups and release your ex for Leo. This is a different deck, you guys. So, I like to get different energy. The Page of Pentacles and Death and Rebirth. Yeah, y'all need to let something go and let it go quickly, okay? The Page of Pentacles here and Death and Rebirth. See that? Yeah, y'all need to release uh, release someone. Some of you guys are stuck on someone that, and, and it's just not um, working out, okay? It's very clarify passion in the tower. Clarify passion in the tower. <sighs> I feel like a lot of you are um, releasing as well. So I'm not going to sit here and be like, Leo, you need to do blah, blah, blah. Some of you are doing that, and some of you, or some of you did do that. Um, so take, take it how it resonates, you guys. If I'm picking up the energy and you're watching it, it could be past. It could be, oh, baby, yes. The lovers. It doesn't get any better than this. 
it doesn't get any better than this. I feel like, you guys, it is going to be so unex... You're going to run into something or someone that you didn't expect you would be attracted to or you didn't expect would approach you. Um, I love it. <laughs> the Seven of Swords on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, somebody might be sneaky, though, to approach. Express your... Exper la, 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 I can't talk. Clarify, express your love in the Queen of Wands. Okay, uh, that's too many, but we have you at the bottom of the deck again, the sun. You guys might be dealing with or meeting another Leo. Spirit, clarify, express your love in the Queen of Wands. There we go. <clears throat> this the Seven of Swords again, you guys. Wow. Uh, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. So we have the Queen of Pentacles now and we have the seven of swords y'all is th this is kind of similar to a reading i did for y'all before i hope this person is not trying to sneak away from one person and come over to you leo the chariots on the bottom of the deck mm. whoever it is is very sure about you though they they have no the, the chariot card is either in or they're out there is no in between with the chariot um, Spirit, clarify this could be the one in King of Wands. Not the chariot came out again. <laughs> Listen, Leo, this person is very, the six of swords on the bottom of the deck. Listen, this person is moving away from somebody and coming to you. Okay, that could be the surprise because this person may come up to you and you're going to be like, oh, I thought you were married. What happened? They'd be like, that's over with. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> All right. I am going to pull from the love, handwritten love oracle. Even I don't think I need to, but I'm just going to pull a couple just to see what comes out. I don't think I need to pull from this. What y'all think, uh, Leo? Because I'm not getting, I'm not getting any past energy. No, I'm not going to pull from this because I don't, I don't think I need to, but I will pull two advice cards. One from uh, two different decks. Spirit, what's the advice for Leo for this situation? Somebody's leaving someone else for you. Um, and I, I feel like it's it's a really great connection. Um, the release your ex too could also be the person that's in your energy. That could also be the, uh, the release your ex. Spirit, give me an advice card for Leo in this situation. Uh, give me an advice card for Leo in their love for their grace and highest good. Uh, there we go. I said one card, spirit. One card. So, give me an advice card for Leo for their grace and highest good. This was a this reading was straight to the point, but now the advice is not going to be straight to the point. All right. <laughs> So we have justice here. Yeah, keep keep being balanced. You definitely have a love offer coming in. The Ace of Cups and the Five of Wands. Okay, just be, this is y'all's energy, the wands. Just be cautious of any type of petty arguments. These, this could be with your ex. This could be this person with their ex. Okay, um, but someone's coming in to offer you balance. Some type of balance within y'all's connection. You guys, um, it could be someone you know. It could be someone you don't know. <sighs> yeah, it's so a, a really balanced connection is coming in. Just be mindful of what the advice cards is what Spirit is saying. Is keep the situation balanced, um, and and just be aware of any petty altercations. You guys also enter inner thoughts as well spirit give me one advice card from this deck for leos and love give me an advice card from this deck for leos and love oh the three of swords you guys okay so yeah this this goes great with the five of wands did not say Page of cups on the bottom of the deck. Didn't I say that there's going to be some conflict? It might be between you and your ex or 
them and their ex or all of y'all. This is this is three swords here. Or all of y'all. Spirit, clarify the three of swords. Yeah. Um, no way. Oh my gosh. No way. You got the five of swords, you guys. There, there's either going to be somebody competing for you or you guys are going to get into some type of competing thing for whoever this person is. You and whoever their ex is going to get into some type of competing energy here. Um, and then the four of cups was with the five of swords. Yeah, you guys. I'm going to pull one more for this. <laughs> Y'all, Spirit is telling you to sit this one out. Please, Leo, sit sit this out. It'll it'll smooth itself over. Um, you have you have justice here, and you have the Ace of Cups here. It it'll work itself out. But just just be mindful of that, because I know how Leos can get. Okay, and especially if the other person's person is a fire sign as well, it's it's not going to end well, you guys. Um, just, just don't engage in any petty situations with this, with this person. This goes for your ex and theirs. Try to be as civil as possible. Okay. Civil as possible. What else does Leo need to know about this regarding this situation? Spirit. For their greatest and highest good. The magician. Yeah. Stay out of it. Stay out of it. Don't even don't even trip on it. <laughs> All right. Don't even trip on it, Leo. Okay, Leo. That is y'all's reading. And again, as I always say, I am extremely grateful for the views, the likes, the comments, the emails, the love offerings, you guys. I appreciate the love for a new YouTuber such as myself. And until next time, y'all. Peace out. Oh, hit that like, hit that subscribe if this resonated with you. I always, I've been forgetting to say that. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, okay? And now, until next time, peace out. <laughs>